the political and economic transition underway in Myanmar is a significant foreign policy development in its own right, but it's also a strategic opportunity for the United States and Japan and their alliance. Uh, they both have an interest in seeing Myanmar succeed in developing more democratic governance, in building its economy, integrating with the region, uh, and becoming part of a transformed Southeast Asia. Japan has a long history uh, of relations with the country. It was their largest trading partner and, uh, and development aid giver for decades. Uh, the United States has had its relationship in fits and starts with Myanmar, but uh, has developed closer relationships with the civil society uh, and, and emerging democratic movement in the country. And it's also an agenda setter internationally in terms of the sanctions that it had applied to Myanmar and has been slowly lifting over the last couple of years. The problem is the United States has a democracy first uh, approach to Myanmar and Japan has a trade first approach to Myanmar. And we are collaborating to some extent to try to improve our programs and, and help the country develop, but there, we're not really adopting an alliance strategy for success in the region because our criteria for measuring progress in the country is different and our timelines uh, for how we measure progress in the country are very different. If we focus too short term on the next election or uh, short term benchmarks on constitutional revision, we may be missing uh, more important longer term milestones for enhancing the country's capacity. Uh, this would bring the United States and Japan closer together uh, in their time horizon for, for strategy development vis-a-vis -vis Myanmar. Uh, another recommendation is to look at ways to uh, share the burden of, uh, of, of uh, assisting Myanmar and playing to each of our country's strengths. So Japan has a particularly strong uh, hardware component to its aid policy and, and building certain facilities. The U.S. has great strengths in its software. Uh, component in terms of building programs and developing uh, human capital. There's another area uh, of collaboration. Uh, it's also possible to uh, maybe have a, a, a burden sharing approach where certain politically sensitive areas that the United States can't get involved in, Japan might be able to, to be more proactive in that regard. Also, the United States should think about lifting some sanctions vis-a-vis -vis Myanmar that inhibit uh, the entry of U.S. and Japanese companies uh, because they can contribute to capacity building in the country and enhance transparency.